Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a, an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. And it is Garfield. I know, right? I love Garfield so much. I grew up with Garfield. Um, I'm one of those people that had like the, the Garfield telephone and the Garfield stuffed animals and I still love Garfield to this day. I think, uh, I think he's iconic. <laughs> the cartoon's iconic. And, um, I have a couple of t-shirts, my, you know, and my husband got me one of them and, you know, I don't do Mondays, that kind of thing. <laughs> but this was, um, uh, this is Sleepy and Grumpy Cat Garfield. It is round diamonds. And I actually, as of recording this, which you're going to see um, pretty much right after I, I record this, they do not carry this anymore on their site. So if you go on there, it still shows it on there, but it says that they don't carry it anymore. Now they do have um, a beginner friendly version of this. Um, so this one here, this size here is a 56 by 56. Um, and this is the image here. Um, they have a 13 by 13 inch. So this is 22 by 22 inch. They have a 13 by 13 inch, um, beginner friendly. I think it's in square diamonds. Um, they do have that one. Um, it doesn't look like it's in stock, but they, they, um, it's still available in the sense of you could probably, um, get notified when it's back in stock. But this one, this size here, this round diamond one, they do not carry anymore. So I'm glad I got it when I got it. They do have some other, um, Garfield ones, but I'm glad that I got this one when I got it. So let's open it up and take a look because since I bought it, um, I don't know how long ago it was, I have not opened it. <laughs> I took the wrapping off right before recording this and um, I haven't even looked at it. I haven't looked at it at all. So we're going to look at it together for the first time. So here's your, here's your sticker here. Diamond shape round, 56 by 56, or a 22 inch by 22 inch. Sleepy and grumpy cat. Um, it's copyrighted by Paul's Inc. It's a Nickelodeon trademark. Paul's Inc. Nickelodeon. Um, toolkit, if you guys know, um, I don't, I guess this is like one of, I don't know if this is an old one, new one. Oh, well, it's a newer one because there's a there's some washi in it. Um, I don't I haven't opened up many diamond art clubs in a very long time, so I got this beautiful foil. This beautiful foil um, washi tape very pretty quite a bit of it too I like it I think it's pretty you've got a whole bunch of baggies in here which is wonderful your heart shaped wax this has got your so it came with an orange pen with an orange squishy suiting for Garfield I've got a heart um, cover binder and if you can see there it is yeah it's like got crystals all over it's not flat it um, you can feel all of the sparkles on it very very cute you've got your what is this a uh, seven placer and a three oh a four a seven and a four placer i'm sorry am i even on camera and then the um clear tray or opaque tray with the glitter 
and it's got the the tray cap as well so I'm gonna put all of these back in here hopefully eh. might leave that cover minder out we'll see <laughs> I really do like that cover minder but let's get all of these back in here and zoom back out so that I can show you guys the painting. If I can get this pen. How is it that the pen, when you first get it, in, when, it when it comes to you, it's in the bag with no problem. And then when you try to put it back in, it does not fit in. Why is that? I don't get it. I have to put it kind of sideways, maybe. That still doesn't work. What the heck? I don't know. Well, I'm not closing it because I can't figure it out. <laughs> I can't figure it out. So let's set the sticker aside and let's cut this open. Now, I've been telling you guys that I've had some diamond paintings that I haven't unboxed yet. Um, I've been saying that for a while, and this is one of them. I've got um, two others. One other from Diamond Art Club and another one from Dreamer Designs. So, this is, this is going to be fun. Well, if you love color blocking, it's going to be fun, I should say. I'm not huge on color blocking, but I do love Garfield. So, and it's round drills, so color blocking with round drills isn't as bad as color blocking with square drills, but I still am very much a single placer. So even though there's loads of color blocking on this, I probably will single place it. <laughs> To be completely honest with you, I probably still will single place. Okay. Now it comes with, as you guys know, uh, any of you who have Diamond Art Club stuff, it comes with a thank you um, with QR codes on the back, um, what's included. Um, QR code for um, instructions, join the Facebook group, you've got instructions there. You also have 10% um, off your next uh, purchase um, code, coupon code, um, you know, all of that good stuff. Then with that, you also have your stickers. I have one that kind of went astray one blank one that went astray I should say so you've got your stickers you get your big sticker and then your stickers for your kidding up and this one here like I said a lot of color blocking it only has 15 colors and it looks like two of them are ABs so you've got two ABs out of 15 colors. Not too bad, I would say, when it comes to the ratio of for your canvas. You know what I mean? Look at those beautiful colors. We're going to look at those in just a minute. But let's open this canvas so that you can see the wonderful Garfield as best as you can. I know I don't have a lot of light right now. I'm going to brighten it up some, but... Um, I don't have my overhead light on because I don't want to um, create more of a glare than what you're seeing here. So, we've got beautiful canvas. It is very simple. Very, very simple canvas. Um, and it looks good. I mean, it's a huge car field. Why would it not look good? Diamond Art Club, I give them this. One of the things that I do like about Diamond Art Club is when they render their 
pictures. They like to make them a little bit more um, cartoony and you know, which is great for a cartoon style. Um, but it's also cool when they take regular pictures because you, you get a sense of it not, um, of, of it being very bold, right? Um, they like to use thick lines. They like to have it to where you can see um, as much detail as possible as you're, um, as you're diamond painting it and the completed version of it. I'm sorry, I'm having trouble with this plastic, getting it, um, getting it not so wrinkly. That could just be a me thing. Could just be a me thing. But it has been in a box for a while too. So that as well is a factor. <laughs> that as well is a factor. But we're gonna look at it. Let me just fix this and, and I'll be done. Diamond Art Club, as you guys may also know, they have very soft backed canvases. They're thick, um, but they're soft backed. And um, so they, they tend to lay out fairly quickly. You know, you can pretty much go from pulling them out of the box as as you bought them to um, to diamond painting, right? Because the way that their canvases are, they they lay flat pretty quickly, so you don't have to worry about anything like that. Ugh. All the air bubbles. I'm sorry, but they bother me. <laughs> I think I got all, all of them out. I have a crease here on Garfield, but that's not really that big of a deal. I don't think, I don't think it's that big of a deal. But you have Garfield in all his splendor, waking up with his bunny slippers on, his cup of coffee, and honestly, that basically is exactly what I look like when I wake up. <laughs> it really is. I am not angry when I wake up. I'm just not awake. So, you know, kind of leave me alone kind of stuff. <laughs> it's what it comes down to. It's like, just, just leave me be. <laughs> but yeah, so it's, it's me. It, that's why I got it because it's me so again it's a it, inches 22 by 22 or a, or by centimeters 56 by 56 um, it is trademarked by Paul's ink PAWS ink um, and it says that Garfield and the Garfield characters are trademarks of Paul's ink Nickelodeon is a trademark of Viacom International slash um, Diamond Art Club. So you have this. Lots and lots of color blocking. I'm just, sorry, I'm just like looking at the image. There's so much color blocking on this. I mean, that whole background, the whole floor is nothing but color blocking. I like how they have the dark lines because here on the bunny's ears right in here is the same color as the background so you kind of need that dark line there so that you don't um, it doesn't just wash it out and Garfield has always been very distinct with his line with his lines and the way he's drawn um, I don't know who the um, I don't remember who the original animator is for um, for Garfield, but I swear 
I've always, I've just always loved Garfield. I think he's, I think he's awesome. He's adorable. <laughs> and you guys know, I mean, these are round drills, but you guys know that Diamond Art Club has amazing drill fields. You don't really have any problems with reading any of the symbols. Um, I think it's interesting, though, that they used numbers one and two for their, um, for their uh, AB drills, but then used symbols for everything else. They only have like three letters in there, four letters in there, and the rest are symbols, which, you know, I don't know why they did it that way, but whatever. I mean, to me, symbols don't mind. I don't mind symbols, but I know a lot of people would prefer alphabet, you know, if, if when possible. People prefer to have the alphabet as their um, key, their legend. So we have some beautiful colors here. I'm going to zoom in. As you can tell, this is going to be kind of a short video. But we've got, this is one of your ABs here. This 141 is a white AB, off-white, so similar to like a 3865. Then you have this 743 here, beautiful yellow, um, and 3340, which is kind of this orange, peach, peachy orange color. There's some stragglers in there in all of these. Some of the white ones, some of the ABs got put in there, which is fine because I can grab them out. I know exactly what they are. So, in those, we have tons of this background, which is your 775. So, this beautiful, like, mint, light mint green um, color. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six bags. Yeah, six bags of this mint green for your background. We have two bags of 310, one bag of your 3865, Two bags of your 3846, two bags of 3843, a bag of 742, 796, 741. That's interesting. We've got four, 741, 742, and 743. All, you know, obviously pieces of Garfield himself, right? Because 743, yeah, I think, yep, yeah, all pieces of Garfield. Then we've got our 606 right here, 817, obviously for the coffee mug. Here's our other AB, 129, this, um, really pretty like a Easter yellow which is highlights on Garfield's tail and um, a little bit on his face and stuff kind of where the sh where the light is hitting Garfield um, you have this beautiful pink 3824 um, and again there's more of that 775 so your ABs, when you're looking at it, your that yellow AB is going to be highlighting right here, just where the sun is hitting it, um, in his uh, what would you call that? Like his lip area, his muzzle area, a little bit there. You've got it a little bit down on his tail, which I know you can't really see, but a little bit down on his feet, tail, and hands. And then the other AB, the 141, it's a little bit in here. It's more on the um, steam coming up from the cup. Um, 
there's a tiny, like maybe one or two um, sprinkled in the bunny slippers, more on the noses of the bunny slippers down, um, down here, which is off screen, but a little more on the noses of the bunnies than anything else. So we've got quite a bit um, of beautiful colors going on with this. If I can get these kind of, let's see, one, two, three. Huh. I'm having trouble. figure out how I want to wrap these all back up. <laughs> couldn't count for a minute. I wanted to get them in threes, but I couldn't. I couldn't count what I wanted to do. Sorry, it's so loud, guys. So I'm not going to do this one right away, um, obviously, because I've had this one in my stash for quite some time as it is. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to get to it, but I wanted to get it because I really like the simplicity of the design. Um, it is totally me. Um, they do have some more Garfield ones on their website, so if you do like Garfield, um, go and check out the website. But I'm really glad that I got this one I did. And I'm, um, I will get it done eventually. I just don't know when. And will it go up on my wall? Probably, because it's so simple and it's so cute. And Garfield's adorable. How do you not love Garfield? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> Alright guys, again, here's your, your full sticker picture here and yeah they like I said this size is not available anymore but they do have a beginner friendly one that is a 13 by 13 inch um, one of this exact design so you know yeah you can't get this one or maybe on a trader site you can but you can't buy this off of their website for now but you can get a smaller version if you really really like this and yeah that's it that's all i really have for you guys so i hope that you like this for now and um look forward to some more unboxings um hopefully uh i'll get some more stuff in soon again i do have um one more uh, one other diamond art club to unbox that you haven't seen yet and i have a dreamer design one to unbox that I've had for quite some time. So look forward to those in the future. And if you've subs if you are a subscriber, thank you for showing up. Hit that notification bell. You'll be notified when my next video goes up. And hit that like button down there. Also leave me a comment. You know how much I love your comments. And I'll get back to you hopefully within a week. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. It really does help me out, and I really, really appreciate it. Um, that's all I've got today, guys. <laughs> Real smooth and easy uh, video. <laughs> all right. So until next time, guys, bye.